Welcome back. It's time to make the most of the sunshine. I'm going to turn the barbecue on and make a beautiful, beautiful barbecue chicken uh, with uh, the side of some lovely fresh salad. So first things first, I am going to get the barbecue going. I'm going to start with two tablespoons of pomegranate molasses. It's a concentrated pomegranate juice. A teaspoon of salt. Half a teaspoon of black pepper. Two teaspoons of sumac. And I'm just going to peel and grate four garlic cloves. And next I'm using the same spoon and adding three tablespoon of uh, rapeseed oil you can use olive oil if you like or vegetable oil and all the grated garlic and i've got this little tub of um, uh, tomato puree i think it's around 70 grams and if you want to know in tablespoon it would be around three tablespoons so yeah then all that's left to do is give it a mix. It does look good, doesn't it? Mm. Look at that deep, deep, deep color of the pomegranate molasses and the um, tomato puree. Almost like melted chocolate, to be honest. So I've got the chicken from the butchers and the best thing about getting it from the butchers is first of all you get really nice chicken but also they cut it however you want. So I've got it spatchcocked. You can just use the whole chicken. Spatchcock just uses slightly lesser time to barbecue than the whole chicken. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to make some slits in this um, all the meaty parts. So like the breast there's no pattern i'm just literally just making cuts wherever the knife will go basically and that's just going to make sure that there's a um, lot of flavor goes inside a lot of the marinade goes inside the kind of okay now there's this lovely, lovely marinade. Oh my gosh, look at that. Just make sure you rub it well. And don't forget to do the other side as well. And if you have time, let it like kind of sit in the marinade for two to three hours. You can do this overnight. I haven't got so much time, so I'm gonna just let it sit for an hour. Look at that barbecue it is ready. I'm gonna put the grill on top. Put a little bit of oil, just so I can place the chicken on top. So I'm going to get this chicken, put it right on here. Just going to make sure I put all the marinade on top. Don't waste any of this delicious stuff. And I'm going to turn this off, close this for you know half an hour and then check it in half an hour it's been exactly 30 minutes my timer has just gone off which means i just need to check it so the barbecue is roughly around 170 c oh my god look at that look at that wow okay so 
Okay, it's going to be quite a task to flip it over. So be careful when doing this. I'm going to flip this over. Wow, amazing, amazing, amazing. I'm going to leave it in this corner for another 15 to 20 minutes or half an hour. I've also placed some potatoes to cook on the side of the chicken. It's been just under an hour, maybe 55 minutes, 50 to 55 minutes. I'm going to get the chicken out on this serving plate. It's kind of falling apart, which is a good sign. And if you want to know what's inside this bag, you will have to watch my next video, which is coming out very soon. Now that it's on the serving tray, I'm just going to seal it till our other stuff gets ready. And also it will continue cooking it that way. So I'm just going to let it rest for five minutes while I get everything else ready. And I'm also just going to put some of these asparagus on the fire. So I've just washed them, a drizzle of oil, a little pinch of salt and some pepper. Just going to make sure everything's coated in oil and they will go straight on to the barbecue. Place these on here. Getting the very charred asparagus out. Here's the salad, and I'm just going to finish the asparagus with a drizzle of lemon juice. Look at that jumbo prawn. So I got a couple of these just for myself because the no one else in the family eats it. So I'm just putting some oil. I'm just going to put it on the barbecue for literally a few minutes. And as soon as they touch, grill them. So you can see the color is changing. So I'm just going to, oh, 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 this is going to be amazing. Oh my. Mm. The salad goes so well. Yum, yum, yum. This whole meal together is fantastic. I hope you will give this a go. Don't forget to subscribe. You can do this exact thing in the oven if you want. Hope um, you will enjoy it. Leave me a comment and I'll see you very soon with another new recipe. Bye for now.